Who am I? A surgeon! Drow? Wait, do uh, dwarders? Are dwarders a thing? Oh, wow. Okay, so dwarf? Dwarger. They do have dwarger. That's so cool. Oh, okay. From fucking... I have already spent 12 minutes in the character customization. Oh, no. Oh, no. It felt like no time at all had passed. <laughs> I'll have him go life. Well, no. No, 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 no. No. We'll just, we'll go into our, we'll, we'll go full in. Actually, wait. While I'm waiting, no man! We'll actually name him after the Dwarger I played. Noki... Dungree. He actually kind of looks like, um, I live in Kentucky, and he actually kind of looks like the blue people from Kentucky. <laughs> I really, I do like that, though. Maybe this. Purple eye, confirm. Agree. Who's that Pokemon? It's Pidgeotto. Pidgeotto. Our Tempest cleric. I'm not going to f make his brother. I'm just curious to see what I'm just dying to see what happens. I got to know. I want to see these two knuckleheads. Noki and his brother that I did not get to name. <laughs> Ooh! <laughs> oh, okay. I was like, why are they getting, like, Thanos, Thanos snapped out of the <laughs> What is happening? Jurgens! Attack! Take down the Mind Flare vessel! <laughs> Gross. Oh, and Owie. Yep. Woo! 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 Yeah, baby. Oh. I was expecting to see a tentacle come and get him. Okay, but what's stopping them from just like doing that like disappear bullshit? Wow! Holy fuck! We've dealt critical damage. Oh, what? Ah! <laughs> what? <laughs> what a problem solver. <laughs> get him! Get him, get him, get him. Chow, those dragons got you, boy. Oh, shit. Well, the ship is crashing. That does not look good. Not even a bit. All that thing came from the parasite now writhing behind your eye. Yeah, I kind of figured. Uh, investigate the pool. 
Some dialogue options require a skill check. A dice roll that must meet... Oh, okay, yeah, I, I've played D&D before. Difficulty cut. All right, well, that's not that bad. Ugh. That's not good. Can I add a bonus? Yeah, let's guidance myself. Why not? I don't think you can do that in <laughs> D&D. <laughs> you can't just walk up to something and be like... <laughs> and be like, I want to investigate this. And be like... Oh, wait, I cast Guidance on myself. <laughs> I mean, a lot of DMs would just be like, yeah, okay, why not? <laughs> well, that sucked. Can I investigate it again? <laughs> yeah, that sucks. You notice nothing more than meets the eye. Reach toward the pool. <laughs> oh. Okay, well, I passed. That's cool. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> Go towards the sphincter. Oh, wait, 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 back. What? Let's see what he has. You got gold. Hell yeah. Eh. <laughs> Yeah. Yes, you've come to save us from this place. From this place, you'll free us. You realize you're talking to an intellect devourer, a minion of the mind flayers who abducted you. Please, before they return, they return. Oh, okay. Please, before they return, they return. What do you want from me exactly? You sound afraid. Why? Kill the Mind Flayer slave before the corruption spread. I, I kind of wanted some, inf some information. From this, body. from this case, free us. Please. Um. Okay. Inspect? Add bonus? Guidance? Yep. Nice. You notice a demon, a swelling of the brain causing pressure where it strains against the shell of the skull. Okay. Attempt a cerebral extraction, staying mindful of the swelling. Oh, man. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. <laughs> what do I want to do? I don't necessarily want to kill it yet. Let's try this. I think we can do this. Okay. Damn. Damn. The brain lifts from the skull, but you notice an opportunity. You could cripple the strange creature, making it more subservient. Buddy, you're weird! Should it prove a threat? Oh, I don't know if I want to do that. Uh, the brain lifts with, okay. Mutilate the brain. Damn, this is weird. Spare the creature. Any injuries might weaken it. I go with spare the creature. pauses listening something behind your eyes seizes in recognition we must go to the helm but the helm we are needed uh what's at the helm 
Uh, what should I call you? Us. We are us. Okay. okay. Wait, I'm very anxious. I, I have a, I have a feeling this is gonna get me in a in a. I'm going to uh, have a problem in just a moment. Wait. Okay, and stuff started to happen the closer we got, so that's good. Nope. It's like Noki, that I just what I just healed you from was fire damage. Oh, I started a conversation. Okay. Throw him with your eyes, bud. You okay? <laughs> what a joke. Well, let's get all our stuff first. The, the guy had a light crossbow. The guy had a scimitar. Skimmiter. <clears throat> Dazed woman is trapped inside the pod. She doesn't notice you. As you place your hand on the pod, you hear something. A presence connected to the pod, commanding the person inside to change. appears dormant the console hums to life but what is its purpose oh Will shit the captain or transform her like that other unfortunate take a closer look add bonus guidance come on yes nat 20 Critical success, that doesn't actually happen on skill checks, but whatever. Pulsing glow and organic lines of the device make it seem more like a beating heart than a machine. This device is different from the one that caused the other captive to transform. Perhaps it will open the nearby pod. Okay, place your hand on console. Suddenly, you feel a hideous squirming in your head. The parasite. Then discomfort fades, and another sensation washes over you. Connection. Authority. Authority. <laughs> yeah! You fucking rule! <laughs> it was a DC-2. The biomechanical brain of the console Process your command and yield to it. A Very cool. Runs across your mind. You 
you feel sated. Hell yeah. And then she dies. <laughs> Dangerous company is what you need in a fight. <laughs> Fair point. Looks like there's plenty of fighting ahead. Let me come with you. We can get off this ship and watch each other's backs along the way. Do you feel what I felt just before we were in each other's heads? I did. It must be because of those parasites they put in us. But that'll have to wait. Are we going to help each other or not? All right, then let's get going. Shadowheart. One moment. What's that? It's nothing. Trust me. Enough of this chatter. We need to get to the helm. Now. She's right. Lead on. Awesome. Ah, oh my God. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Holy shit. Self and sacred flame on. I was gonna say shield tiger cleric too. Um, let's do shield of faith on her. I'm wondering how much health that mind flare has, but it would be a better idea to just leave. Don't waste a step. On the move. It's clean. Hurry before they strike. It's talking about. Oh, the okay. <laughs> Just that face. <laughs> huh? <laughs> Damn. 
Oh shit. Gotcha, bitch! Oh, where's my party? <laughs> oh, nice. As you wake, the tadpole squirms in your skull. Uh, check yourself for injuries. Other than the infection, you're more or less intact. A miracle, given everything you've been through. But it'll all be for nothing if you don't find help soon. The tadpole is a death sentence, and the clock is ticking. You need a cure. <gasps> Shadowheart, no! Oh no! Yeah, take the thing that was in her hand that she was being shady about. Take it, take it, take it, take it, take it. Oh, wait. I, <laughs> I didn't see that. <laughs> Wake her. Hello? Ow. You're alive. I'm alive. How is this possible? You're weird! I was hoping you might know that. I remember the ship. I remember falling, then nothing. Uh, do you have any, any idea where no. we are? I don't recognize this place, but anything's an improvement on where we just came from. First Fair enough. First, we need supplies, shelter, and most of all, a healer. We might have escaped, but we still have these little monsters in our heads. What happened to our gith friend? You might want to reconsider calling her a friend. Looks like she ran off without us. You want to stay together, I take it? We need each other. And we both know what's at stake. Can't think of better company. Alright, let's get moving. One thing. Just before we go. I wanted to thank you again. For freeing me. It would have been all too easy for you to run right past my pod. But you didn't. I'll remember that. Lead the way. We need to find civilization. More of those wretched things. And also, if I hadn't freed her, I wouldn't have a. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, shit. Noki's dead. Hurry, I've got one of those brain things cornered. There, in the grass. You can kill it, can't you? Like you killed the others? There. Can you see it? Uh-oh. <laughs> Just a dumb boar. You're relieved. Until you see the flash of a dagger. I just need information. I saw you scuttling about on the ship. You were in league with them, aren't you? Those tentacle... Ah! Your mind twists. You're looking out of unfamiliar eyes, prowling dark, busy streets. You try to hold the memory, but it fades to the worm. The light. The fear. 
What was that? What's going on? It's the Mind Flayer's worm. It connected us. The worm? Of course. That explains things. Somewhat. And to think. I was ready to decorate the ground with your innards. <laughs> Apologies. <laughs> A kindred spirit. My name's Astarian. I was in Baldur's Gate when those beasts snatched me. My, my. You've been busy. So, did you learn anything about these worms while wandering the ship? Uh, yes, unfortunately. It'll turn us into mind players. Into... Ha! <laughs> of course it'll turn me into a monster. What else did I expect? Although, it hasn't happened yet. If we can find an expert, someone that can control these things, there might still be time. You know, I was ready to go this alone, but maybe sticking with the herd isn't such a bad idea. And anyone that can crash a mind flare ship and walk away seems like a good person to know. All right. I accept. Lead on. You approached the dying monster. This is the thing that abducted you. You could end its life here and now, if only you didn't feel... compassion. Compassion? Yes, you feel hate. And you deserve to be punished for it. You should be whipped, made to bow before this creature in shame. It's possessing your mind, forcing you to love it. But then the feeling slips. The creature's mind seems to focus elsewhere. Intelligence concentrate on its thoughts. <laughs> Your minds fuse, lusting for something that is gone. But then its grip claws back with a vengeance, a vice locking your mind into obedience. It needs sustenance to survive, and with your very body, you can provide. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was like, uh, that's bad. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> Barely. <laughs> the monster lies exhausted, defeated. Its eyes, wet orange pearls, radiate malice. Uh, if I leave it, it could captivate something else close close its eyes forever you approach the sigil on the stone magic glitters and swirls from it erratically as if malfunctioning it looks slightly dangerous leave there is no need for me Zoru was right. Yellow was a toad. Oh, hey. Okay. The thing's dangerous. Leave it for the goblins to kill. Your skull pounds in response to the prisoner's white hot stare. Her lips don't move. 
Yet you hear her voice. Get rid of them. Holy Hells. Under Dwarf. Lay time, my mister. If you value your life, walk away. Guidance. <laughs> Just use guidance on everything. Why not? <laughs> Definitely. Demaze. Come. <laughs> Say please. Never. <laughs> Like a good moment to talk. Questionable intellect. Unsurprising. Release me or enjoy a future as Geich. Mind players, the atrocities we are becoming. I know a remedy. Release me and I will share it. The tadpole hasn't yet scrambled all your senses. Auspicious. But the longer we wait, the more it consumes. My people possess the cure for this infection. I must find a crash. You will join me. Careful. She obviously sees your kindness as weakness. Don't let her take advantage. I thought you already had a cure with you right here. You may as well suggest a wyvern bow to worms. The cure I offer will suffice as thanks. A pity that. I made an offer and you accepted. Your fantasy is not my burden. Well, I don't like her. <laughs> you have made an ally from Kresh Kalir. Few know such fortune. Call me Lazel. I'll trust your judgment, but I won't trust her. Not until I've gotten the measure of her. You've a sharp tongue, elf. Would that your mind proved its equal. Ha, huh, elf. I suppose the finer details are lost on a creature like you. That was the most racist! Wow, guys, the chill. <laughs> mentioned a camp. One there, this Zoru, has seen Githyanki. A crash must be near. We will ask this Zoru where he has seen my kin. 